Yo, what is going on, homies? It's your boy Stumps back from the OPTC video, and in today's video, we have a new legend, Olin and Otama. Sugafest is here. End of the month, new batch legend, and as always, we're gonna be doing some summons. I want to put a disclaimer in this video: I do not recommend anyone summon on this banner. Literally, in a month's time, we have news. Like the best banners of the years are coming. So, save up all of your gems. Don't go summoning on these banners. Unless you guys are going to be making videos or re recording stuff on these characters. Or if you just really love Big Mom, then go for gold. However, like I said, I would definitely save until New Year's. Don't be like me. Um, I, I actually just really like this unit. I really want to test her out in some areas of the game. And I really want to make some content on her as well. Um, I have been a bit MIA at the moment as well. Obviously, with Kazuna, Life, the new Pokemon game. I have been, haven't been streaming as much. haven't been doing as many uploads. Uh, don't stress. We're all good. We're all here. Um... But we'll be back at it once sort of like the Pokemon craze and stuff starts to die down a little bit as well. But let me know if you guys are playing the new Pokemon game in the comment section below. And if you're summoning as well. But most importantly, while you're down there, don't forget to pop the like button for me. If you're new to the channel, hit the big subscribe button. With that said, let's dive on in. So no stream today. I do apologize about that. 10% um, red rates and the new Otama is very, very good with this Olin. So if you guys pick up Olin uh, V20,000... And you pick up the Otama, you're going to be in for a very, very good time. It's nice to see Sunny because those characters haven't come back since their release. So, can't stand this guy, man. I can't stand this guy. Of course, they put Katakuri on the banner, and he's the first unit I pulled. We obviously got some new uh, level limit breaks as well, which is pretty interesting. V1 Kata actually, speaking of Katakuri. Actually got his level limit break expansion. Pretty interesting stuff. Having a 6 star and a 6 plus is actually quite effective now. Obviously side grades. Level limit break makes them a little bit more viable to actually have two copies of the character. So um, pretty interesting there. And obviously Katakuri being a character for the new Big Mom Super Tandem ability is fairly interesting as well. Now I haven't really... Off the top of my dome, I can't really remember exactly what this Big Mom does. I do, know, do remember she's on a 33 uh, turn cooldown, which is absolutely wild. Two reds, by the way. Let's go. Let's go. Um, I do remember she's on a 33 turn cooldown, and she does paralysis. She does burn. She's a self blocking conditional booster, if I'm if I remember correctly. Uh, okay, there's Sengoku. Uh, if you guys checked out my um my tickets, we actually picked up the last copy we needed for Sengoku. So it is what it is. I really like that unit, though. I think he's a very very underrated unit. Ulti page one, another character that's from the Wano series. Good to see them popping back up, but I have just finished them out as well. Cracker, he's going to be very very good for big mom teams. Any of the... I, I think Crack is on there. Because Big Mom is a super tandem unit. It's Big Mom and Hera, right? Um, any of those Big Mom pirates that are powerhouse, that are driven, that are in characters, are going to be very, very good for this particular Big Mom. Multi number three. But yeah, like I said, she's an interesting character. Um, she's going to be very, very cool to use in stuff like Grand Voyage, especially... Um, I want to I wanna see how she goes in Variate, because I think Variate is just way harder than what... Um, the grand the grand party orange town versus uh luffy is but i do want to take her in there as well and that luffy um grand voyage is actually it's actually double single what? super tandem tablets what um that grand voyage challenge is actually done very very nicely i saw the flames and i was like yo this cracker all the by the way another very very good unit to use underneath big mom or with big mom um but yeah as i was saying that grand voyage at orange town with Huh? Huh? What's going on? This man literally got him to the Super Tandem level 3 in two multis. What the heck? My god. Alright, so we get the new Otama here. Fantastic unit for Big Mom. Looking like our first dead multi, but it is what it is. Um, Yes, going back to what I was saying. Holy dooly. Uh, okay, no, not dead multi. There's a red. The Grand Voyage at Orange Town with Luffy against Luffy and the Alvitas Hideout, I do think are the best two Grand Voyages because they're not easy, but they're not like crazy challenging and they have just so many different options to beat them now. There's no like units that you like, you have to bring and if you don't bring those units, then you're not going to be able to complete it. There's just an array of different options. Like... Alright, so this is going to be Otama, which is great because if we pull the Big Mom, this Otama is just like an absolute clutch for the Big Mom team. Mainly because um, she can actually only use her special once, but reduces special charge by four turns on a chosen character, and then locks crew slots one turn and doubles the slot effects. So obviously you give that cooldown to Big Mom, 
and four turns is just absolutely insane. Big Mom, as a captain, she um, gives herself cooldowns whenever you take damage. So this Otama not only triggers the super tandem, part of the super tandem ability, however, she can actually just help Big Mom get those cooldowns without having to stall too much and take too much damage. Because I think the big downside to Big Mom, right, is to get her stage 3 special, which, by the way, you're never going to see. Like, you're never going to see that stage 3 special. Um, it's just, it is what it is. Um... The fact about it is it's, doesn't, it's not like insanely broken for a 33 second cooldown. So the, bringing cooldown reducers and obviously boosted events are going to be where Big Mom sort of shines the most. Um, but nevertheless, like, I think her kit is just, it's good enough. What is going on? Three in a row? Bro, where's the 10% gone? He started so strong. Um, I think that her kit is sort of like the way it's designed is hitting the head on it's now what, what they're trying to do is hitting the nail on the head with the first two stages anyway so don't be too bummed about the 33 second cooldown if you get it you get it you don't you don't it's kind of like blackbeard right like that um the dex blackbeard because in a blackbeard you never really see that stage three special however he's still a very good unit even without it so look big mom like i said not a unit i would chase if i was 99 percent of the community um but and for me i'm that other one percent i guess <laughs> Like I said, though, if you're a huge Big Mom fan, you love the way this unit works, you want to do some summons, hell, I ain't going to stop you. I ain't going to stop you. But just remember, New Year's is around the corner, and there will be some big, big things coming. Some big, big things. It's New Year's. There always is. Is this a four red multi now? Is this just made up for the, to the, the previous dead multis? Jinbei, I can actually use that for level limit break. Shame Jinbei's already been kind of used for his, like, Grand Voyage. But I guess he could come back for, like, another one, right? Another red. New big one. <laughs> Not ideal. I don't think I finished my V1 Akainu though, so that's kind of that's kind of cool. Moria. Moria, are you finished? I want to say Moria's done. Another very, very good unit to use alongside Big Mom, by the way. So if you guys don't have this Big Mom, like you have like Moria, you have like Super Class Katakuri. Uh, hell, you have V3, Big Mom. That's another really, really good option. Big down thing I don't like about this actual Big Mom is she's actually a super type unit, right? She's not a super class. Yes, I get it. We don't need any more super class powerhouse unit stuff. I know, I know. But with, is it V3, Big Mom? Um, she's actually a super type already. And it would have been really cool if this unit was a super class. And then you could just hybrid the two up. Would have been really, really cool. Would have been really, really great. Where's the Frankie rare recruit, by the way, guys? I have not seen this Frankie rare recruit. Any, anyone seen him? Okay, there's Otama again. Fun. Cracker. Right, my crack is one fifty. So that's that's a yikes. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna go to ten and then we're gonna call it there. I've got some other ideas that I want to trial uh, on this Sugo Fest as well with some summon stuff. Um, so we'll probably come back to the banner tomorrow, probably maybe the next day. Uh, we'll see how we go. But I, I do have an idea that I really want to sort of trial with you guys see how it goes with just a few multis and then sort of like doing some quick team building stuff i think that could be kind of fun so in today's video i'm going to stop at 10 i'm going to call it a day for this particular video where's frankie bro is there is there two other rare recruits Dust. Okay. i swear there's two other rare recruits on this banner yo i swear i swear there's a frankie and i swear there's something else but look i'm just a jabroni in a chair with a microphone this one's a, li a, a limited pool Sugo Fest character. Um, am I bugging or is there... Uh, is there? Okay, maybe there's not. Maybe Frankie's not on this part. Maybe that's, that's why I'm not seeing Frankie. That's weird. Let me know in the comment section below. Alright, last multi of the video. And then we're going to wrap it up. Let's go. Limited pull Sugo. Any on the way? Okay, there we go. Another one. Come on. We are looking for Big Mom and Hedda. Big Mom and Hedda. Big Mom. Another gym. No worries, game. All good. That's fine. I didn't want to make, like, content. I didn't want to make videos. I didn't want to... I didn't want to do stuff. So that's fine. It's all good. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't worry about it. I didn't want to do stuff. It's all good. Don't, don't worry about it. But that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you guys summon, you have better luck than me. Let me know in the comment section below. Uh, if you are summoning, best of luck. Uh, if you're not, 
Good job, safe and news, and busted luck on that banner. But most importantly, enjoy the rest of your day. Felt the like button, hit the subscribe button, do all that good stuff. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Later!